Hi everyone. Uh, so in this video, we'll be seeing the live exploitation of this particular vulnerability. Uh, the CV is assigned to this vulnerability. So let's just discuss a bit about this particular vulnerability. Uh, so this is a local privilege escalation vulnerability. What do I mean by that is suppose you have a user um, called test okay, on a particular machine and that's a normal user and on Linux machines you have a root user that's some kind of administrator account so in case you want to escalate your privilege from normal user to the administrator account you can utilize this particular vulnerability and the uh, the main thing about this vulnerability is it is found in this particular utility that is called pk exec and it is installed on almost all the Linux operating systems out there it is even installed on the Kali operating system which is uh, mostly used uh, for security application or security uh, network security testing so on that as well if you try to uh, utilize this particular uh, vulnerability to escalate your privileges from normal users to uh, root account it would work so we'll uh, just uh, get into exploiting now so let me show you my virtual machine uh, this is my Kali machine and this is actually the updated one only the latest updated you can see 2021.4a version it is and I will show you uh, what user I am right now so I am uh, the Kali user as you can see after running who am I command we can see we are Kali user and we are not the root user actually if I try to uh, switch my user to root using su command and I don't exactly know my own password as well so uh, if I give anything it's not going to work because we are not the root user and we don't know the root user's password so now how we can utilize this particular vulnerability to to escalate our privileges and become a root user so uh, what I will do I will try to find the exploit code or the POC code for this vulnerability so how you can do it uh, there is a person uh, yeah so there is a github repository where the person has already hosted uh, his uh, POC code so if on Google if you search something like this CV and then if you search like this uh, in URL colon Raya guard so you will find that particular URL as well okay so this is uh, the POC code here this is written in C language we will compile it and we will get an executable and when we run that execute we will become a root user so I will copy this particular URL and uh, we will download this from this URL okay so how you can do it on your machine first of all I will go to my temporary directory okay on Kali Linux into slash TMP and here what I will do I will use git clone git space clone space the URL that I copied and that way I would be able to download all the files that is there uh, on that particular uh, endpoint just a moment destination path already exists so the thing is I already have this just a moment so uh, because I had downloaded this particular thing already that's why it was not allowing me to download using this command so yeah I have removed that folder already from my local machine it's not required for you because you would be downloading it for the first time so now if you run this command it is going to clone everything from this particular path okay this path and now if you see here if you run ls command you would see that there is a folder called cv 2021 Now I will clear the screen and I will go into that folder using cd command now we are in this particular folder within temp directory here if I run ls command you will see that we have the um, the c uh, code here and we have a make file as well okay uh, we are not going to discuss how uh, the make files and everything work but if you run the make file directly what it will do it will compile this code okay and it will generate the executable from this particular code so I will just run make and there are some warnings uh, just ignore this part but now if you run ls you can see that there is a new file that is exploit I will again clear the screen just for be better visibility now if you can see that there is a file called exploit and if I see what are the permissions on this using ls space hyphen l you can see that here on this particular file this is a an executable file okay and it is created by our Kali user only now before running this I will show you what user I am 
I am the Kali user. And now I will run it how you are supposed to run it. You can use dot slash. Uh, this only means your current directory and within that you are running exploit. As soon as you run, you can sh see hash in the beginning. Normally those who are aware of Linux systems, they can see whenever you sh see a hash in the beginning, that means that's a root user terminal only. And I can verify it using who am I command as well. So we have become root. So yeah, that's all about it. In case you guys have any doubts regarding this exploitation, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.